Welcome back. It's Coach Reed Hall here. If you're new to the Reed's Workouts channel, I help volleyball players and coaches learn how to effectively jump higher, hit harder, and defend better by gaining strength, power, and improved movement patterns safely and effectively. In this video, we're focusing on lateral defensive movements and drills so you can cover a much greater area of the court. This is actually video two in a four-part series on how to become a faster, more fluid-moving volleyball athlete. If you want access to all four of these videos and the written out description of the sets and reps, click the link in the description or the link maybe over here. I don't know. That link will be somewhere. Find it and you get access to the full program. Anyways, guys, let's dig in. Our first lateral drill is called figure eights, but before you go, let's review. Good volleyball posture, that's a good athletic posture. Breathing, you're very nice and relaxed. Eye gaze forward. So start going into figure eights, and we're working on that push, right? That push is really important, and shoulders need to stay the same height. So freeze for a second. So when she, when Sophie's moving that way, she's driving off her left leg, and she can feel that left glute go. So drive that way, go around, good, come back, stop. Now she's going this way, the right leg, or the right glute is producing the power to get around. Good, stop. So we do anywhere like four figure eights and then rest. Four figure eights and then rest. And I wanna show you how we can use a volleyball on this as well. So what's gonna happen, I'm now gonna to toss and attack the ball to Sophie. She's gotta be doing her figure eights and I sequence the ball. As soon as I'm about to ready to contact that ball, she's a stop to defend the ball. So it'll look like this. So I'll go this way. Keep going, push, figure eights, high gaze, four, keep going. Good. Again, keep going. Push, push, get around. Hey, Dave. Good. And now what you're trying to focus on, you can stop here, is she's doing her figure eights, but she's watching that ball in the air. And right before I make contact, she has to be stopped and loaded. And when I say stopped and loaded, that means I need to stop my feet and my weight is now going forward. So I'm in a relaxed position, but my weight's not going either way. I'm stable. So watch how stable she is when she digs this ball. So I sequence, stop and load on contact. Go. Keep going. Good. Up one, keep going. Good. So that eye sequencing part is very, very important. Watch that ball, stop, load, let's go. In this drill, we're gonna work on a crossover step. Now this crossover step is very important whenever you're defending and you need to cover a lot of distance. So if I'm defending in the cross court as a beach volleyball player and I need to chase a ball down the line, there's a long distance that I need to go, that's when you're gonna use this step. Or if you're playing six in volleyball and you need to chase down a ball, maybe run through a ball, a crossover step if you're moving laterally is a very good option. So we're gonna start off with two cones. I'm gonna get into good volleyball posture, shoulders forward, relaxed breath. I'm gonna put, if I'm going this way, I'm gonna push through this leg, so I'm crossing over, plant, if I push through this leg, cross over and sprint through. Okay, so Sophie's gonna demonstrate this without a ball, and I'm gonna give you another demonstration of how we can include the ball. Sophie, get it. Good. Let's go just one more. Go the other direction this time. Good. And I'm sure Sophie's getting a little bit tired here, but I'm gonna show you how we do this with what we call a run through. Now this is more popular in the women's game than the guys game. So Sophie, I'm gonna take your spot for a second. So what I'm gonna do is, if I'm gonna cross over that way, I'm gonna make her chase the ball down that way. So what will happen, I'm gonna start in a flow, good volleyball posture, push, cross over, plant when she gets here, I'm gonna toss the ball that way. Now you're gonna cross over, keep your shoulders forward, run through, move your platform through the ball, have the ball land softly right back here. Let's see it. Okay, let's go this way first. Go. Good. Good. Let's go one more. That was excellent. Let's go the same direction again. That looked great. Watch how she's keeping her shoulders the same height. Go. Good. Well, that was a little bit easy. But you can see how she's very fluidly moving through that ball and she's not wasting any energy. Okay, so we're going to progress our two movements. My recommendation, if you're a very beginner, or very new to volleyball, let's maybe not go to this level yet, but we're gonna do our banded shuffle move and our banded crossover step. So first we're gonna do our banded shuffle, so push, 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 get there, decelerate, control the way back. So she's driving hard through her leg, that's closest to the pole here. So the band here, she's driving through the right leg. What you really wanna feel when you're doing this is the glute work. When you push that heel in, that glute work. So you just come back here and pause. So when I'm doing this and she's 
pushing that way, it's this foot pushing the ground. Now it's powerful, but fluid and rhythmic. You should feel that glute working. Shoulder's gonna stay the same height. Give me a few more, so it'll be push, good. Control the way back. One more, push, drive, good. Excellent technique and everything. So the second exercise is now with a crossover step. So it's gonna be a good volleyball posture. So she's gonna push this heel in the ground, sweep that leg through, sprint, and then when she's coming back, side shuffle, she's actually decelerating the movement on the way back. So load, push through, run, decelerate that movement. Okay, one more. Push, load, decelerate, good, control the way back. I appreciate you tuning in. If you found this video helpful, then click the link. I don't know where it's going to be in the description somewhere. Find that link and you'll get access to all four videos, the written descriptions of the sets, reps of each exercise, and it's completely for free. There's no strings attached. This just helps me educate the volleyball community even further, and that's my goals. Anyways, guys, I am out.